At the recent 66th Summer Fancy Food Show held at New York City's Javits Center, the Specialty Food Association Transporter Panel sought products gaining prominence in the specialty food industry. The trade show featured more than 1,700 exhibitors offering specialty foods and beverages from around the world. We do uh, business a lot, uh, Hispanic market and Asian international market. There's so many, so many markets within a market, right? So the 50 different states have different regulations. So it's understanding kind of what might work on the East Coast versus the West Coast. We're just starting to build it up a little bit. We've got a lot of shops in uh, New York City, like independent shops. The specialty food marketplace has grown into a $175 billion industry fueled by creativity of the producers of these foods and beverages. The minute you get done with one thing, people say, well, what's next? Well, and as we chew, we get to smell more of it, and then the taste intensifies. That innovation was on display at the summer show, with our transporters highlighting unexpected twists on classics, reconceived packaging options for you indulgences and comfort foods, global flavors, and growing interest in sustainability and ethical production. Yeah, this is our like, hometown flavor we all find is it's very good and a good memory. Trends noted by the panel at the 2022 Summer Fancy Food Show were as follows. Surprising sips, beverages with unexpected flavors and ingredients, including spicy sodas, coffee made of figs, and drinks spiked with everything from alcohol to sparkles. Probably low stuff, yeah. Yeah, because everyone needs it. It's so popular. The, for us, the U.S. market is the, the biggest uh, market, and uh, we 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 just see that there's uh, the best. I mean, big opportunity. Packaging innovations, single serve, compostable, greater portability with less mess. So we're all about yeah. use what you need, and this is all compostable. Vegetable chips, vacuum or flash fried tomatoes. Mushrooms and vegetables bring in new options to the ever-evolving chip category. We are trying to modernize the cuisine because everybody thinks it's like Ethiopian food, eat by hand, eat with injera. But we have amazing spices that you can mix with other things and modernizing the cuisine. Sustainable and ethical choices foods and beverages with sustainable and ethical characteristics from upcycled or regeneratively grown ingredients to products that support the livelihoods of undeserved communities. I think the biggest problem is branding. A lot of people don't eat, they don't know what Singapore is, um, and they don't understand what sambal is either. So it's very fun to, to help share our food culture with the Americans here. Alternative comfort food, a transporter panel pick as a top trend of 2022 with bases like sunflower seeds, tiger nut flour, chick peas, bananas and peas now emerging. We are all no sugar added but the flavor has to be there. So we, have, we, we pride ourselves on flavor first, then no sugar added, no junk, no chemicals. We have the ceremonial and the, the matcha that you can use uh, for, I don't know, pastry or different, different kind of things. Peppers are hot. Another top trend for 2022, peppers and traditional pepper sauces and condiments from around the globe. I think it's just uh, making the right connections and finding the right distributors at this point. Play with your food. Whimsical products such as edible candles and animal-shaped cheese delighting kids of all ages. Other noteworthy products discovered by the panel included infused ice honey, a modern take on the traditional Indian frozen dessert, chocolates with South Asian inspired flavors, umami powder, and freeze dried candies and ice creams. Because they're so delicious, people keep dip, telling their friends to come and try some more. So it's been. The leading trade association and source of information about the $175 billion specialty food industry for 70 years, the SFA represents manufacturers, importers, retailers distributors, brokers, and others in the trade. From the International Desk, this is Science Wu, China America Radio.